All right, yo, what's good, everyone? Nick Smith is back. Welcome to another episode of the My GM series with the Indiana Pacers. Right now, we were we we simulated a couple of games, and so we're 14 and eight, going up against the New Orleans Pelicans. Only bad news is. We, uh, I mean, we're doing well in terms of, uh, you know, the power rankings and the standings, whatever. The conference standings, I mean, we're doing pretty well. These are the scoring, um, you know, the scoring options. But the Pelicans, they're doing better than us in terms of the win-loss ratio. We're just higher because we're in, um, you know, we're in the East. So, yeah. But I did want to say this, all right. We're going into this game without Pineapple Head, Miles Turner, or Hassan Whiteside. We got the old man Jermaine O'Neal and Sheck Diallo the Rook going up against Anthony Davis. One of them's going to be matched up on Anthony Davis. I don't know who it is. I think it might be Sheck Diallo, uh, you know, on when Anthony Davis plays power forward. But if he gets switched to center, old man Jermaine O'Neal is going to be matched up on him. That's not a good thing, okay? We, you know, when you when you face up against Anthony Davis, you. You just have no chance, all right? Especially in 2K. And the thing is, this is based pretty much off last year's ratings. And you know Davis was an absolute beast last year. He was meant to have a really good year. Ooh, look at that dunk by Eric Bledsoe. But he was have a he was meant to have a really really good year this year. One of one of the top MVP, uh, you know, caliber players um, last year. And he he's kind of undelivered in real life. And I I was surprised by that. You know, I thought he'd be playing a lot better than he is right now. The Rook. Oh my goodness, Check Diallo throwing it down. You're going to see, I try to go to check early in this game. Eric Bledsoe and Check Diallo, you're going to see, I try and work a little bit of a two-man game between them, um, but on the on the defensive end, the Pelicans have Davis, and that that's all that really matters. If you have Davis in 2K, you, uh, you're you looking good, all right? But yeah, like I was saying, I'm trying to get the young guy, Check Diallo, involved, so he gets the nice Denied. dunk right there. He gets a beautiful block right here, and he's celebrating. He's letting the crowd know... I'm, I'm, a, I'm a beast. But the thing is, Davis, he can hit the three now. He can hit the mid-range and the three-point shot. But check, Tialo gets another block. This guy is a beast. I'm telling you guys, if you got a My GM series, pick him up, all right? If you if you have embraced the Pacers roster... Denied. Look at that block right there by DeMar Rosen. But if you have embraced the Pacers roster... You gotta get Czech Diallo. Trade for him, draft him, do whatever. Just get him on your squad, alright? He's a beast. He's so good. Paul George getting the foul. That wasn't that should have been a foul. It didn't count, but yeah. Oh my goodness. PG settle down. That was insane. Paul George just went higher and higher. And so did the old man Jermaine O'Neal. He threw it down right there. So going into the second quarter, we have a four-point lead. Another block. KJ McDaniels, he sends her back. In real life, his hair is going a little bit crazy right now. He's got this crazy afro going on. Anyway, Eric Bledsoe, three-point shot. Now, that's why I got him, I guess, because he can hit the three. Unlike Derrick Rose, Eric Bledsoe has that three-point and the mid-range shot pretty much down. A guy that doesn't really is uh, DeMar Rosen. By the way, he, he's getting a lot of blocks in this game, but if I sound a little bit sick... It's because I have a little bit of a cold right now, but I've got to get videos out for you guys. You know how it is. Anyway, I wanted to say, if you guys want to see the next episode of this series, let's see if we can reach 600 likes. You know, the likes have been going little, it's going down and down and down each video. So I want to see us get back. Oh my goodness. Did you see that block right there by Anthony Davis? That was crazy. That's great defense by Davis. That was insane. But, you know, the likes have gone a little, like the comments, they've been rising. Every video I make, all the comments seem to be going, like, you guys just going ham in the comment section. But the like ratings, they seem to be, they, they, they're down, okay? They're a little bit down at the moment. So let's see if we can get them back up to what they used to be. Let's see if we can, if we can reach 600 likes for the next My GM episode. PG, shot clock winding down all day, every day. We're only down five, going to the second half instead of being down eight. All right? We shouldn't even be down five. Like, we're facing up against the Pelicans. And although they don't have... Uh, although, sorry, although we don't have for some white side or pineapple head, we gotta, like, we gotta go to work, okay? I mean, the, the Pelicans are not that good. In this series, they're good. But, like, it's 2K. They haven't acquired anyone. Plus, they don't even have Eric Gordon. These guys, like... I don't even know, man. It's just... It's hard. Like, I don't know what it is. They're just good. And the, they're not even good. That's the thing. They're not even good. I just cannot play with the team I have. All right? I, I'm not even going to lie. I can't play with the team I have. 
I can't play. Like, I reckon I was better last year when I played. Like, we lost. Oh my goodness, did you see that slam right there by Tomato Rosa? But we played up against the Cleveland Cavaliers in the last episode of this series. And I was like, if we lose one more game, someone is getting traded. Because they have to. Like, no way am I losing. Alright, I understand the Cleveland Cavaliers. But if we lose to a team like the Pelicans, then someone's got to be traded. So, I know I asked you guys in the last episode on who you wanted me to, uh, to trade and who you wanted me to get. But there was so many goddamn comments. I have no idea on really who you guys want me to get. So, I want you guys to comment down below. Again, another one. <laughs> I want you guys to comment down below. A player that you want me to get and a player that you want me to trade from this team. But also, um... Comment, like, if you see somebody else comment that that same player that you want me to get, then give their comment a like. So it lets me know that you, you also want to see that player as well. Um, I, I read a lot of comments saying that you guys wanted me to go after Jimmy Butler and uh, a few other guys like that. So I'm going to have I'm gonna take a look around and see who I should get. Demar's just beat. Like, I, the thing is, like, I don't even really want, like, a lot of you guys also were saying that I shouldn't even trade anyone. Like, the team is really good as it is. And I'm not going to lie, it's pretty good. I like the way the team is. It's a pretty nice team. I just can't play well with this team. I'm, I don't know why. Like, maybe it's because we don't have Hassan Whiteside and we don't have Miles Turner in this game. But we shouldn't lose to a team like the Pelicans. And right now, we're not, we might even win this game. Like, we might actually win this game. It might go into overtime. Who knows? You guys will have to find out because PG now is at three and it's back to a two-point game. At Drew Holiday. I mean, we, we got to have better defense than that. Then they also picked up Deng as well, but Drew Holiday gets an and one right there. I don't even know how. Like, that was that was defense. Well, I guess it wasn't, but Davis plays defense right there. I get a quick steal, and Czech Diallo makes, makes up for his miss, getting that slam dunk to go. So it's a five-point game, one minute, 45 seconds left in this game. Davis trying to get inside, and he does get the layup to go, celebrating... On the other side with the timeout. That that thing right there where he was celebrating, it kind of looked like he was about to dab. Paul George. Oh my goodness. He slams it down right there. He's a guy that definitely won't get traded from this team. It's it's an Indiana pace of my jam. You cannot trade Paul George. But I wanted to say also, I've got some pretty exciting videos to come out um, throughout the next couple of months. Um, even, you know, throughout this month. Um, it should be pretty exciting. I'm going to do like a Vancouver Grizzlies My League um, a few episodes of that. I'm also going to be doing like, um, I'm going to be doing like a whole ton of what if scenario videos. So like what if Kobe Bryant got drafted to the, to the uh, Charlotte Hornets. And I know that Crispy Flakes also does that type of thing. Um, so we might also collab, um, collab during this year. And I might also collaborate with a few other YouTubers as well. Agent Zero and a few other guys. So yeah, but as you can see, we lost to the Pelicans. Down five. We lost by five points to the Pelicans. No player had a standout game, which is terrible. Like, I guess now that we have a better roster, our players seem to have more... They they shoot less, all right? They don't get as many shots up, which happens in pretty much all teams. If, the, if you have more than, you know, one superstar, then you have to share the rock, right? You have to... Like the Cleveland Cavaliers, they have to share the rock. Any big three, you have to share the rock, all right? So, we have like a big four, pretty much. Like, we have a big five, all right? We have a nice team. Everyone has to get a bit of a touch, and uh, yeah, it it was just, I don't know, man. Everyone's getting touches, and nobody's dominating. Like, I don't know, man. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave that like, subscribe. If you're new, comment a trade, leave a like. I'm out. Peace.